What's up, guys? The only ninja wearing aviators on a Superman high, bringing you another episode on Combat for Dummies. Here we are celebrating a momentous occasion. Well, uh, at least for me, it, it's going to be a little delayed for you because right now is actually um, second week in Avatar month, for, at least for me. Like right now, the second video or the second combat for dummies for that series is out right now. So if you haven't seen that, definitely go back and check that out. But uh, this is going to come in December. This is going to come a little bit later for you guys. But for me, I just got a new toy. My personal sword, 10232 included, is finally here. And so with all that said, I'll have a uh, weapon log coming out eventually for it. Uh, I don't know if that'll be before or after this video, but a weapon log will come out eventually. But right now, we're going to take this momentous occasion to have a lighter sword and do the first trick combo or trick for you guys to learn with our sword. So let's get to it. Alright, so you guys, we got a little bit lower so you can see a little better. This is just where it's nice for me to set you guys on my car because I'm using my car because there's nothing else around here. I'm in a parking structure, basically. There's nothing to set my phone on. So, my car will have to work right now. Now, what we're going to work on today is our toss. Now, not that one. That was a little bit based, a little more advanced. So, that'll be coming up later. And if you want to see me do more of these sword combos and sword tricks that we can combo into different different combos and stuff like that definitely let me know down in the comments uh and if you want to see what i've been doing what i've been practicing practicing with this sword definitely check out the uh link down below for my instagram definitely check that out because i post a bunch of martial arts videos on there so with all that said let's get into the combo so what we're going to be doing is tossing it just like that now it looks pretty simple but it's not always simple so just Hold up, hold up, listen to me, listen to my pointers, and then we'll go with it from there. So the first thing, obviously, is you're gonna wanna start with your sword away from your body, because if it's too close, you're gonna nick yourself and it won't feel good, guaranteed. With that said, you're gonna put sword tip up and handle down, and that's how you're gonna get that spin. You want it to spin somewhere around the center of the blade so it doesn't spin off center and hit you. You don't want it to spin on this center and hit you too, there too. You want it to spin right here so that you get a nice catch roughly where you let it go from. Not exactly where, but roughly. Now, another thing to point out is when I catch this, I catch it like it's falling into my hand. You don't want to reach out for it or try to grab it before you get down there. Now, those are different tricks and for and for a slightly more, I messed that one up. Whoop, there we go. Slightly more advanced version of this trick. But for right now, you're gonna want it to fall in your hand just like that. Bang. So that is going to be the first Combat for Dummies video with my sword. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I really like this spot up here, actually. It's right by my work, and there's a bunch of tall buildings and stuff like that. It's nice, clear sky, so I might come up here a little more often. But until next time, hope you guys enjoy. If you want to see more sword stuff, let me know down in the comment section below. Till next time, my name's DJ Moore. This is the Modern Ninja. And I'm out.